90 Day Fianza Before the 90 Day star Tyre meets the real Carmela, who is the woman in the photos that Christian used to catfish him. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, please subscribe and keep watching for more details. After four years of online communication, Tyre meets the real Carmela and is shocked by her appearance, admitting that she looks even better than in the photos. Tyre reveals to Carmela that he was catfished by a man named Christian using her pictures, leading him to question her involvement in the scam. Tyre had developed a deep connection with his catfisher, believing in the persona of Carmela and even giving money despite being unemployed and having an ill mother. He now realizes he was fooled and may consider meeting the catfisher. Tyre Mollet is finally coming face to face with the real Carmela, whose photos were used by Christian to catfish him on 90 Day Fianza, before the 90 days. The 33-year-old Tyre is from Modesto, California, and his 90 Day Fianza storyline has been the most unbelievable one during Before the 90 Days Season 6. He started talking to 27-year-old Carmela from Barbados after meeting her on a dating app. Their conversations were about their future together apart from the naughty videos and photos shared between Carmela and Tyre. Tyre's online relationship continued for four years on Snapchat, but the spell was broken when the show's producers exposed Carmela's real identity. According to a preview clip shared by People, Tyre goes to Denver, Colorado to meet the woman. He's awkward when he sees her, is tongue-tied, and can't stop giggling. It's weird, I'm sorry, he says. To the cameras, Tyre mentions, to see her in the flesh, I'm dumbfounded. I'm like, oh my God. She's dressed nice. She's got her nails done. She looks even better than in the photos. Tyre adds that this was the person he was in love with for four years. But he knows that at the same time, she was just the face and not the person he was talking to. It's hurtful to note that, he admits. Tyre has told Carmela about everything that happened. She knows he met his catfisher on a dating app. Then I found out she was actually a man named Christian, and he was using your pictures. It's crazy, he shares. Tyre reveals that Christian had approached him first, and he even thought that it was weird, because usually girls don't really do that. Since Carmela also finds the whole situation ridiculous, he mistakes it for her being guilty and probably involved in the catfishing. So I have a question. This is weird. I'm sorry, but you don't have anything to do with this, right? Tyre asks Carmela up front. According to Tyre, his catfisher has been telling him what he has, Carmela, wanted to do in life. She wanted to model and travel the world, which made her Tyre's ideal type. Slowly, Tyre developed a mental connection with his scammer. It could be why he was refusing to believe that he was catfished, that Carmela in his Snapchat messages wasn't real, and that he was just being used for money that he gave away despite being unemployed with an ill mother at home. Tyre was told by his sister Ashanti that she did a reverse image search on Carmela's pictures and found out she was an escort living in America. Tyre did not agree with his sister, so he hired a private investigator. The investigator confirmed Carmela was an adult model. Tyre reached out to the real Carmela and asked to meet him. Tyre seems to have finally realized that he was fooled into believing that he had a girlfriend. It will be interesting to see if Tyre now shows an interest in meeting his catfisher he might just come to the conclusion that he did not fall for the woman in the pictures, but instead for the person who talked with him every day for four years before his decision to take his love story to TV.